Hello guys, Dico here. I've made a 24 hour digital clock and right now it's about to spring to it's going to jump all to 0 p.m. so let's take a look and I'm going to tell you it's all going to be exactly at the same time There we go. Bam. It's very quick, as you can see. It's also very accurate. It's exactly one second. And it's also pretty compact. This is all of it. I have five of these tapes. Wait a second. I have five of these tapes, three of twelve long and two of ten long, and each tape is actually two tapes as you can see. And it's very easy to make this a twelve hour clock, it, ex it just extends one at each side, actually, if I change this. Which is not really a problem. If you um, don't want 24 or 12, you can just take this out and put some gloss in over here, like this. So that's very easy. And as you can see, it's just a T flip flop. It's very simple. You can very simply turn it back to BM or AM just by having a button with the one tick pulse going into this piston but make sure that you don't power this redstone over here just the piston and not the redstone um, I hope you like this uh, maybe I can do a tutorial on this one it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen long behind the wall. It's fifteen high, so fifteen by fifteen. And then, depending on if you have it twelve or twenty four, with twelve, that's actually the whole clock, is this? From there, that point over there, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty nine. So pretty compact. I'm not sure if it's the smallest. I don't think so. But I just wanted to show you, and I hope you like it, and I'll see you next time.